Hello Raw folks, it's great to see you all here again at the channel. This is your regular dose, as you know, of Raw News and Analysis. We need to get your fix today, but before we move on to any further details, I'd just love to thank you all for the support that you've given us here at the channel. We really appreciate it, and if you haven't done so yet, I know you guys probably have, but just in case, make sure to subscribe to the channel and press the notification bell because it really helps us out. And that way you won't miss out on any of the latest videos. As soon as we upload one, you'll get a notification. So. Perfect. Um, let's get started on today's video. So Meghan Markle's absence from King Charles's coronation has been a blow for British fashion, a top style expert has now claimed. Miranda Holder, a fashion stylist who has worked with celebrities such as singer Boy George, has recently posted a viral video about the impact of Meghan Markle's absence from the coronation, as the Duchess is known to bring some Hollywood-style glamour to royal events. Miranda said... Whether you're a team, Meghan or not, you can't deny that her absence from the coronation kind of makes things a little bit less exciting. Now, particularly on the fashion front. She went on to describe Meghan's style, which is more relaxed and natural when compared to the more sophisticated elegance of the beloved Kate Middleton. Miranda added that Meghan looks happiest and most radiant when she's dressed in ripped jeans and in an oversized shirt. As the fashion expert said, the Duchess had a California cool approach to style. But despite Meghan's relaxed fashion, Miranda said that Meghan also knew how to dress for more formal occasions too. Miranda said Meghan does bring her own certain brand of glamour to big occasions such as wearing super brand Dior to the Queen's Jubilee and the almost old Hollywood style glamour definitely stands out against the rest of the more conservative British royals. They look lovely but they have a completely different style and it just made it fun, a bit of variety and something for us all to look at and talk about. Miranda added that Meghan literally um, clad herself in designer armour for public occasions in order to avoid the critical eye of the media and the public as she was getting more and more negative attention. Miranda has said that if Meghan had to decide to attend the coronation, it would have been a very clever PR move. She explained the Duchess could have won a big British brand and gave them some support in order to earn some much appreciated PR. Miranda said it would have in turn given Meghan some positive PR which is definitely needed and it's all a bit of a win-win. However, Miranda added that sadly despite all the positives here, Meghan will not be at the coronation and so we won't get to see this scenario play out. The fashion experts ended on a positive note though and said let's hope there can be a reconciliation at some point in the future. So, what do you guys think about the news? We want you to tell us in the comment box below. Do you think there will be a reconciliation in the future? Do you think Meghan is just trying to grab as much spotlight as she can through Archie's birthday after she declined to attend the King's coronation? Please let us know in the comments and we'll see you next time for more Royal News and Analysis. Bye for now.